Hello everyone, it's me Reline back to you with another video. This video pertains to the recent controversy surrounding former Heisman Trophy recipient and now Georgia Senator candidate Herschel Walker as a woman claiming to be his former girlfriend and one of his child's mother came forward to inform the Daily Beast that Herschel Walker made her get an abortion in 2009. The reason why this story is gaining traction is Herschel Walker is running on a campaign promise that if he is elected, he will ban all forms of abortion. Now, though this moment should have been a private moment, this man wants to have an abortion for himself alone, but other persons currently in 2022 and beyond don't deserve the same opportunity of getting an abortion. Make that make sense. We all know the allegations of Herschel Walker allegedly harming his ex-wife with a weapon, lying about giving money to veterans, lying about being a FBI agent, lying about being valid Victorian. How many times does this man have to lie and embarrass his family in the process? Now, what a lot of person didn't know was Christian Walker was over the foolishness behind the scenes, allegedly. He went on a Twitter rant and baby, Christian said what he said and he said what he meant. And he was not finished as he spoke out more about what him and his mother and his siblings have gone through with their father. Now you will watch these brief clips and I will be back with more commentary. Admitted against my mom were downplayed. I stayed silent when it came out that my father Herschel Walker had all these random kids across the country, none of whom he raised. And you know my favorite issue to talk about is father absence. Surprise, because it affected me. That's why I talk about it all the time, because it affected me. Family values, people. He has four kids, four different women, wasn't in the house raising one of them. He was out having sex with now, other women. Land, this is atrocious. People on the right are pulling up that I did a campaign event with my dad last year. They're saying, well, you supported him all last year and all this year. You look suspicious. No, no, no. You all have been calling me saying, why aren't you on the campaign trail with your dad? Why aren't you helping him out? This looks weird. You should go help him. And I've said to you calmly, I'm not getting involved. You don't know my family life. I did one. Of After the release of these videos and tweets, persons within the guardian of Putin party went on the attack on Christian claiming that he was working with the Democrats. This is false. This young man is not working with the Democrats and for Herschel Walker to continue the lies that his son and others are lying about this situation. It screams that Herschel Walker is not ready for the Senate at the federal level. Persons in Georgia, I need you to understand how serious this is. You cannot allow someone who preaches about accountability and is not taking accountability in their own home. If it worked out for Herschel Walker back in 2009, why is he now in 2022 trying to prevent other women of taking control over their own bodies and over their own choices? This is a dangerous man. And the guardians of Putin are ensuring to overtake the little democracy we have left. Do not be fooled. Elections are critical this year. Georgia, you are one of 36 states that have governor races. Your last day to register for this election season 
is on October 11th, 2022. Then on October 17th, early voting begins. If your state allows early voting like Georgia, please take advantage. If your state allows absentee ballot voting, please take advantage and understand that federal, state, and local races are critical because elections have consequences. Elections matter. Please be safe out here and I will see you in the next video.